to stay sober and sane and not repeat the same mistakes. Although we will experience a lot of hardships and setbacks, we should still be hopeful because the good is right in front of us. This wolf's fate was extremely tragic and it suffered many blows, but it unexpectedly survived. No matter what, we should always try our best. No matter how miserable we were before, we have to keep moving forward and forget our previous sufferings. Life is very short, and since some things do not belong to us, we do not need to force them. Everyone's life is unique, and we can be happy and live alone. Many times misses happen from time to time, but we will also meet friends with the same ambition. Will the animals meet their friends? Let me tell you the story. In California, this woman came across a wounded wolf. When the woman found the wolf, it was severely injured and its eyes appeared to have lost their luster. The woman guessed that it was probably a blind wolf and was still struggling for help. For this wolf, it was not as enthusiastic as humans. Many of its family members and friends needed to run around in search of food, so and they all had their own things to do. Therefore this lonely wolf was left behind. This wolf's pleading sound carried far, but its partners were not there at all. Even though the echoes were loud, the other wolves could not hear its cry for help. If it was an ordinary animal, it might have died long ago, but why did this wolf persist? At the moment it was saved by this woman, the wolf was extraordinarily grateful to her. There is a deep stigma between humans and animals, but when this woman saved this wolf, this wolf did not remain indifferent, but was very gentle, which made this woman feel incredible. The wolf did not show a fierce and irritable expression after seeing the woman, but had no glowing eyes, which made the woman feel very heartbroken. After the woman brought the wolf to the rescue center, the wolf became more docile and cried. Maybe its wish was fulfilled and it was able to get away from the pain. Time passed quickly and the wolf's wounds healed a lot. When the woman took the wolf to the rescue center, she found out that the wolf was pregnant, so she took more care of the wolf. She was always worried that the wolf might have a difficult birth because of the injury. A few days later, the baby wolf was born successfully. When this woman first encountered the wolf, it was dying, yet afterwards it endured the pain and gave birth to the baby wolf. At that time, this wolf was a first-time mother, so its behavior seemed awkward. When it first arrived at the rescue center, it was very unfamiliar with everything, so it was worried that the baby wolves would be abandoned. It felt embarrassed because it was blind and had baby wolves. The wolf felt that it had caused a lot of trouble for the woman. So after the cubs were born, it took them in its arms and wouldn't let anyone touch them. But the wolf had just given birth and had no strength, and it was weak, so it could not take care of the wolf cubs. Sensing the woman's repeated visits to the cubs, the wolf hoped she would adopt them. The woman had children, so she knew the greatness of motherhood, so she agreed to the wolf's request and prepared supplies for the newborn pups. The wolf cubs were cute and delightful. This female wolf might not have enough to eat during its pregnancy, so the newborn wolf pups were very skinny. So the woman purposely gave it more nutrients, so that it could feed the pups to grow up faster. After the woman's patient care, the wolf gradually healed after giving birth and the wolf cubs began to learn to walk. Although they were very young, they were as strong as their mother and would get up after a fall and continue. These wolf cubs were very progressive, so this mother wolf felt very relieved. It was happy for them to live independently. Although wolves naturally like to be alone, it doesn't mean they don't have rich emotions like humans do. Sometimes they have more emotions than humans, just like this wolf. This wolf was willing to give everything for its children. It was its greatest happiness as long as its children could grow up unharmed. This wolf's mother's love was as strong as humans. And this wolf would be as grateful as human beings after getting help. At that time there was a wolf who went out at night to look for some food. It did not encounter any problems until it found its hunting target. Just when it was about to move, it accidentally fell into a well because it was too dark. The wolf was stunned and tried to climb upwards, but the width of the well was limited and it could hardly move. In order not to continue to slide, it wolf tightly supported its body with its paws while it was trying to climb upward. 
Unfortunately, the night passed, and the wolf did not climb up. After that, it felt that its limbs became weak and its body condition deteriorated. The wolf kept wailing and was very afraid, not knowing how to climb up. The villagers nearby heard the wolf's cry and rushed to the scene. When they found the wolf in the well, they understood. In order to save the wolf, the villagers brought a rope and prepared to lasso the wolf. However, the wolf under the well did not know their intention, but thought it was in a worse situation, so it kept avoiding the rope and showed a fierce expression. In desperation, the villagers had to call the local experienced snake catcher. When he saw how resistant the wolf was, he decided to save it in other ways. The snake catcher used a stick as bait and then withdrew backward. The wolf's eyes were almost focused on the stick, so it didn't pay attention to the rope. Finally, the villagers managed to put the rope on the wolf's body and dragged it up. After being rescued, the wolf realized that these people did not come to hurt it but wanted to rescue it from the well. It was because of the enthusiasm of the villagers that the wolf survived. This wolf was originally very fierce looking, but after being rescued, it became gentle. The wolf stood on the ground after being rescued, and it did not hurt the villagers but slowly left from them. At the moment before it rushed into the woods, it stopped for a while, as if it wanted to say goodbye to the villagers. After the wolf ran into the woods, the villagers also left. Through this incident, we can know that wolves are not cold-blooded and heartless animals. And they can sometimes become gentle like humans. Although they look fierce and this cannot be changed, we can sense their changes through their behavior. It is through this incident that the villagers have a new perception of wolves. And this wolf was very grateful to humans for helping it. Okay, that's the story of today. If you like it, please click subscribe, like and comment. We will continue to tell you more touching stories about animals, so we will see you next time.